I haven't worked in this area for the last four years. Uh, I've really got to know the place and I absolutely love it. It's definitely one of London's busiest creative hubs. Every street almost I can think of has a production house or maybe an art gallery. So you've got your independent creatives but you've also got the BBC around the corner as well and that's, that's pretty cool. You've got lots of different restaurants and bars and they cater to everything. So if I'm going just out for a quiet drink with a friend, I've got some nice little places. But if I want to go out with a big group of people then that's also available as well. There's loads of independent coffee houses so if I want to just grab a quick lunch with somebody then that's, um, that's it's just around the corner. Food wise, you've got everything. You've got sushi, steak houses. I mean, some of the best restaurants in London are situated right here in uh, Fitzroy, which is really handy. I also love the fact that the British Museum is around the corner. They often have um, kind of challenging exhibitions and you know, it's just a wealth of um, culture there. Being in the centre of the West End, there's always something to do. But if you do kind of want to get away from the hustle and bustle, you, you couldn't be in a better place. There's parks literally everywhere. And I've also you got uh, Regent's Park, which is beautiful and absolutely huge. Buying a house in this area, which is you know obviously really cool and vibrant and slightly affluent, has been made so much easier with the help of the shared ownership scheme. So basically you buy an initial share of the home and then you pay rent on the remaining value of the property, which works out still cheaper than what you would pay for a similar house from a private landlord. Then you also have the opportunity to increase the percentage that you own in the house, which is that's, that's pretty important, I think. Uh, I'm really, really looking forward to getting on the property ladder. I think, you know, London's a really expensive city. If you can get on the property ladder, if I can do that with one of my first goals, then I'm definitely over the moon about that.